Hey everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how I turn this denim gilet into a bow back gilet. Here's what it looked like before. And here is what it looked like at the end. First I'm going to mark how wide I want the panel for the bows to be. As the seam of the gilet is a V-shape, I'm going to make my panel in a slight V-shape also. This means my bows will be small at the bottom and slightly bigger at the top. But you can decide how you want to design yours. Here I'm seam ripping the waistband. And the top seam. Now cut out the panel for the bows. My panel is just under 20 inches tall, so I'm measuring just under 1 inch from the top and the bottom and then 3 inches in between. The one inch section at the top and the bottom have a purpose, so don't throw them away. Cut out each section and I would advise you at this point to use a sewing machine to sew a tight stitch around each section. This will prevent the bow from later frailing too much around the edges. The easiest way to make the bow is to pinch the middle section, then pinch the top and then the bottom. Hold it in the middle, arrange the bow around the edges and sew together in the middle. Repeat this step for all the bows. Now taking those small sections from the top and the bottom, I'm cutting them in half lengthwise. This is to place over the stitch in the middle of the bow. This is the part where you need to decide which way you want the bow. I had to ask my husband to help me decide whether to have a light bow or a dark bow. Once you've decided, take the small sections and sew a tight stitch around the edges. Cut them to size and stitch them over the middle section of the bow. Before I sew the bows down, I need to tidy up these edges. So first I'm going to fold over the edge and I'm going to sew it into place. As you can see this has made a difference but it still looks ugly on the inside. So what I'm going to do is going to fold over the edge one more time and create another hem. Now you can see how much of a difference this makes to the inside and to the outside.
take your bows and arrange them in place, spacing them according to your preference. Once you've done this, pin them down temporarily. To pin them down properly, you need to pin each side of the bow wrong sides together with the edge of the gilet. After pinning all the bows down, you should have a gape at the waistband and along the top seam. But this will be fixed next, so first sew down the bows in place. To get rid of the gape at the waistband, I need to add two darts. So I'm going to seam rip the waistband, realign it and create darts under the side buckles. Now sew this down where the lines are showing. For the top section you can add two darts here, but I decided to seam rip along the seam, completely realign the top section to fit and sew it into place. Okay, so my battery died doing this last part, so here I'm drawing my new armhole, then I need to seam rip just this little section. After that I cut slits before hemming it back down. To create the hem, fold over once, then once more, and then sew into place. Do this for the mark section on both arms. And here is the final outcome. 
I can't wait until the bows start to frail around the edges because it will give it a nicer effect. Please like this video if you enjoyed how I did this. And for more DIY tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to my channel.